Welcome back to Behind Times Gaming. This is JD, and we are here on good old refresh day, guys. Good old refresh day. So let's take a look at some stuff and find out what's going on this week in Destiny. Okay, first of all, we're going to take a look at the Nightfall, guys. So the Nightfall this week is going to be the Shield Brothers, guys, and it looks like it's going to be a rough one. So we have Epic, which is heavily shielded and highly aggressive enemies appear in great numbers. Followed by Brawler, which is Guardian melee damage is greatly increased. We have Chafe, which is player radar is disabled, so that's no radar, guys. We have Match Game, which is enemy shields are resistant to all unmatched elemental damage, which means you're going to want to work with your party team to make sure you have the correct damage types, the correct elemental damage types, so you can knock off any shield that comes up, guys. And finally, we have Exposure. So Guardian Shields are increased, but they do not replenish. So the damage you take, guys, those shields are not coming back. So you're going to want to be real careful. You might want to, uh, before boss, before changing areas, maybe leave an enemy alive and let that enemy kill you and then revive your friends so that you can get all your health back. That might be a nice little trick that I know we use a lot in Prison of Elders is the whole dying and coming back to life to get past exposure. You might want to work, use that a little bit in this nightfall. I'm not sure with exposure if in the nightfall being able to heal yourself with orbs or weapons will work, but that's that's something I'm interested to see. I know in Prison of Elders it did not help. So we'll see what happens in the nightfall. Next are the Vanguard Heroic Six are the same. Again, heroic and fresh troops. Make sure you guys run at least three of those to get those legendary marks and legendary ingrams. Uh, today's daily is going to take you into the Vault of Glass, guys. This is the daily in the Vault of Glass. This might be the one that allows us to do a side mission to get into that secret area that was found and get Praetis Ghost. So look for, look for news on that coming around, popping up on the internet. I think this might be the week that that happens, guys. And it's going to be Rumble this week, guys. So if you guys still need some of those Rumble kills for your Grimoire, this might be the week to do it because everyone's going to be in Rumble trying to get the marks, especially especially today and tonight. There'll be a lot of people in who aren't really good at Rumble just trying to get their marks. This might be a good time for you to jump in and get those top three rankings so you can get the Grimoire done. It'll be super easy, guys. Go do it now. So... Other than that, the only thing that is left, guys, is the Court of Oryx. So, the Court of Oryx this week is back to Kagur. So, that is the wizard that shows up with a Seville Ogre. So, this, this fight is a three-part fight. So, the way it works is you have Kagur, which has a shield that is invincible. And then you have this Seville Ogre, who is also doesn't take a lot of damage. But the third step of this is that you also have Maleficent Eyes that pop up, guys. So what you need to do is you need to kill the Maleficent Eyes and that will give you that will give you a bonus that lasts about 10 to 15 seconds. Now this can be stacked up to three times. Uh, so the bonus is called Ogre's Fury. So you can stack that about three times to get extra damage and drop the Ogre. Once you drop the Ogre, then you can start putting damage on Kagur. Now you gotta be quick with this with your whole team because another ogre will come back and you'll have to repeat the step to keep trying to drop Kagur. So that's how this tier three Court of Orcs is gonna work today, guys. Go out there. If you didn't get the first week, go out and get that Calcified Fragment for killing Ga Kagur. And I'm really hoping there's gonna be a new Calcified Fragment for the Nightfall where it's Shield Brothers. We'll see if this, if this confirms my theory yes or no well guys that's it for this week's refresh i hope you enjoy this week of destiny and i hope to see you all hanging out around in destiny if you guys want to hang out and play with me make sure you drop by my twitch you follow there and then you can hang out and you can play the game with me we run crucible we run night falls we certainly do run the raid so i hope to see you all there other than that, make sure you guys like this video, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, and jump from my Twitter and follow there as well for all the news and updates and a little bit of my life that seeps on through. But that's it for now, guys. Hope you guys have a good week, and hope to see you all back inside Destiny.